starting uh, week 38 kickoff. Um, had a five mile recovery run, real easy run. Evan and I ran around the block here in the neighborhood and uh, kept it 10 to 15 beats below ceiling. <clears throat> Extremely humid. You can see I'm just like totally drenched. Uh, but got it done. So uh, legs felt actually okay from the ride yesterday. Um, happy about that. So we get a day off tomorrow, I think. I'm sure we do. And then it's back to a swim on Tuesday. Week 38. Guys, we're just so close. So, okay, stick with us. We will see you guys uh, Tuesday. All right, everybody. Tuesday swim, week 38. Yeah, week 38. <laughs> Losing track. Uh, 2,500. 50 yards, I think, something like that. Uh, man, a bunch of uh, fin work, and not with the uh, the kickboard, so I had to use the fins and swim. And uh, you know, it sounds like you're cheating until you do about 2,500, about 2,000 yards of that. And uh, wow, that wore me out. Uh, and also wore two holes in my big toes with that rubbing of that <laughs> right on the seam of that uh that flipper so anyhow um got it done tomorrow is a trainer ride and i think it's going to be easy i think from here on out we've got you know just kind of a low effort work workout um, i do have a long run like a 12 mile or 13 mile run on Thursday, but that's, you know, as long as it's going to get, and, uh, anyways, pretty good, uh, pretty good workout, so shutting her down, we will see you guys, you can see me, see you guys, uh, tomorrow. Okay, well, we got our, uh, Wednesday 45 minute, uh, training ride in, it's 15 mile easy ride, which is what I did. I kept it kind of high RPMs and, and light in the pedals, so I um, feel like I'm cheating, you know, <laughs> kind of a mental stress of like I'm not putting the, the work in, and uh, but it's by design, so anyways. Um, okay, so tomorrow I've got a 12, I think it's a 12 mile run, um, and we'll get that done down at the waterway at the uh, race loop. and. Uh, and that should be just about it. We've got a 75 mile ride Saturday, uh, but that's the last long ride. So anyways, uh, really winding down. So, uh, okay, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, um, got my Thursday long run done. Um, I, uh, was not the best run. Um, it was supposed to be kind of an easy uh, effort, which I, I did keep my heart rate down uh, five to 10 below my ceiling. Really humid. Um, I really think the air quality or something was just bad because I could not catch my breath um, like I normally do. Um, and I don't know if it's <clears throat> just con my congestion or you know, there's a lot of pollen in here. <clears throat> Ozone, they were talking about it this morning, actually. I think that may have had something to do with it. I don't know. Uh, it just wasn't really that great a run. And um, it was a 12 mile, uh, 12 mile run. And I just, uh, you know, kind of forgettable. Anyways, done. Um, tomorrow is Friday, got a swim. And boy, then, then the long bike, 75 mile bike on Saturday, and that's it. Next week is gonna be a real easy breezy week um, to help the fitness come back. So hopefully that will happen. Um, we'll go from there. Okay, signing off, see you tomorrow. Well, got our Friday swim done. Week 38, 2,800 yard swim. Uh, some uh, warm-up 200s and then a big thousand uh, of varying efforts 
uh, and then a bunch of, of hundreds. <clears throat> uh, pretty good workout. Actually, I felt pretty good. Um, did work on some spotting, which is always important, you know, before a race. Kind of get acclimated to that to that rhythm because you lose a little time, you know, every time. I do it about every eight strokes. Um, <clears throat> and I look up right before my, my breath. And... Um, you know, you got to kind of get focused on that <laughs> so that you um, you don't lose a lot of time or miss a breath and choke out, you know. So, anyways, uh, did that the last uh, set of, of four 100s and worked pretty pretty well. So, I'll keep working on that uh, in the next uh, two weeks um, of swim sessions to, you know, kind of just make sure I have it down. Anyways, uh, so look, the weather tomorrow is bad gonna 100% chance of rain thunderstorm which means lightning so more than likely I'm gonna flip-flop my Saturday Sunday workouts do my, my recovery run tomorrow and then it's supposed to be zero chance sunshine on Sunday and I hate to do it but I'm gonna just have to do my long my 75 mile long ride on Sunday so that's the game plan unless something changes overnight i uh, got a cool front or cold front that came in and it's not really cold but it's bringing this weather so anyways all righty guys uh signing off we'll see you tomorrow and we'll take it from there hey everybody well got my uh saturday long ride in 75 mile easy effort ride um in what I'm thinking is the fiercest wind I've ridden in, at least in memory. Uh, I've probably said that before, but uh, that north wind, it was terrible. Um, I mean, I had to get out of the saddle on some false flats. I mean, you know, you don't do that. It was terrible. Um, my quads are burning, you know? I mean, I was a, literally two miles per hour slower on this ride, about the same effort as the last road ride, the 112 mile bike that I did in the wind and the rain. So it's not like we haven't had wind. We always have wind, but this wind was uh, like a wall, man. Anyways, kind of glad that's over with. Um, so, rounding out week 20, uh, 38. Uh, we did, did do a flip-flop, so I'm actually Sunday, but anyways, got it done. Uh, we're into the True Blue taper now, so uh, going forward, forward, we'll have uh, much lighter workouts and uh, let the body recover, so. Okay, everybody, appreciate you sticking with us. Uh, remember, go to my Ironman Foundation webpage and uh, check out our fundraiser, Melissa's Promise. Um, we are raising funds and awareness for tying vines. Their humanitarian work for Syrian refugees in Lebanon is just fantastic. They're doing great work, so check it out. Uh, you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, the whole bit. Uh, almost finished with this deal. Stick with us and we will catch you at the recap.